hot pocket. Roll. Water. Bible. Except we don't need Bible. Good, good stuff, folks. That's right. Food and God go together very well. <sighs> wonder how many people get yawned by just doing that. Okay, anyway, just want to let everyone know, once again, I'm trying to put this on my website, my, uh, to my YouTube and my live video. Once again, I'm trying to make YouTube my primary audience. I do have a live video that I am using also. But YouTube my prime audience. And if you do have a question or comment or email, email me. There, my email, regular seven 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 at gmail .com. So if you have a email, you can email me there and you know, send me your questions or suggestions or what I should do in my next video or or what you think of the, the video I just I'm doing now or whatever. So well, anyway, if you don't. Are Christian, you're watching this, or if you're one of my subscribers, you probably already know about happyjesusday.com. If you are one of my other subscribers and you have, don't know about it, I'd recommend go to www.happyjesusday.com in your URL browser if you're done watching this video, obviously. And this site was put up by Christopher L. So, just put that in the video description for him. Thank me for that later, I'm sure. Mmm. So, I have a couple of um, ideas I'm going to do for my next couple vids, videos, I should be saying. I'm in a chat room, by the way, while I'm talking on video at the same time. So, I'm still I'm thinking of... Uh, Shortening my words into little little acronyms, you know, videos, vids. By the way, BTW, you know, I'm still thinking of chat room right now. So if I say something like, uh, I don't know, WTR for water, <laughs> then just you know, putting that in your comment. Quit saying using so many acronyms. Come on, man. This is this is uh, America. We're supposed to be using English. Speak English. English. Here you go, folks. So I got a, I got an air show. It's a little Thunderbird. If you know what kind of plane this is, F-16 Thunderbird. They paint them up and they have little air shows and they go all over the country. That's what they look like. <laughs> uh. If I offended you by my uh, what? Which my call? Oh yeah, my Cleo video. And I'm sorry. I thought I was I supposed. I'm trying to make it funny as possible. So if you were like uh, believe in that, and you were offended. I'm sorry. So I apologize to you now if you are offended. Heck, if you're offended by me just like eating this this hot pocket or or um or or um I don't know me talking too much or make too long of a video. Like I know I had a comment that said I had too long of a video. Oh my goodness. So Um, I'm going to address a question in a comment to Kiwi Free, right? His question was, okay, this is an interesting question. Would you, do you see life as some sort of journey you have to get over and done with as soon as possible so you can get to, quote, heaven or something? And I said in my video, you said something that's like a good way to pass time. This was in my... Um, responding video to Jesus Freak in overcoming sexual temptation and sin. Uh, that was the response video he's referring to. 
why it would, why would you want to pass waste time? So, I don't. If you're the person watching this Kiwi free ride, I I don't see life as a journey to get it over as done with as soon as possible. No, but because Jesus said we are supposed to be disciples of their teaching, preaching, teaching, and preaching is the same thing to all nations on the earth. So, it's not life is not some sort of um, um, some sort of something to, 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 I know it's, God gave it to us not only to worship Him, but to have fun in a sense at the same time. So in a sense I do see it as a journey, but at the same time I, I kind of see life as, as a time to accomplish the mission that Christ set upon us as disciples at, of all nations. So, hopefully that addresses the first part of your question. Um, I'll move to the next part. And you said, or I said I should say, something like it's a good way to pass time. Why would I want to um, pass or waste time? And um, my only response to that is I'm not, you're not really wasting time. You're not passing the time. This the reply video was made through a video to a person who had problems with their uh, sexual temptation, and I suggested doing hobbies because I was assuming the person uh, didn't have a hobby and they um, went to their uh, tem temptation. They were succumbing to their temptation, so they gave in and did that rather than have other things to do besides like I do, reading or or um, making videos to you or. Um, you know, so, anyway, I gave you a couple links, I gave you, uh, um, a question post, of, or a question answered, I should say, so, my question is to you, my viewers, what, what do you want to see me do? I know you probably don't want to see me do Cleo every day, because that was, it was kind of fun, but at the same time, I want to preach, or preach. Okay, I, I want to preach to to the not just the Christian community, but to the the, the person who subscribes to me because because they want to hear the word of God. So I'm asking the Christian community right now, what what do you want me to do? Just and in this video, I'm just going to go ahead and allow automatic video responses. So if you want to make a video response and say, Bear Killer, I think you should make a video about sin, or I should make a video about... I don't know. Going up elevators. So I'm speaking... It's like my next video. And speaking of going up elevators, I had this time I pressed the button in the elevator, and the power went out. Boom, boom, boom! You know, I like this little sound effects and everything. Okay, anyway, I'm getting sidetracked, as you can see. So, this video is not really had a focal point. I just wanted to give you some updates and some a kind answer to a question. And I talk about elevators. <laughs> and, uh... And, yeah. So... Make sure you read your Bible every day, and hope God blesses you all. And make sure you visit happyjesusday.com. And like Christopher Elwell always says, have a happy Jesus day. Alright?